वंदे गुरुपद द्वंद भक्तबिंद श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंदसहोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदवनम मनोहर वाचाकुवश कि पासीवच पतिता पावनेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचा लंग पंगु लंग हैतगिरी जत्तमहंग वंदे परमानंदमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव सच स्नभक्तिपद देवी सत्वत्वी नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नर चरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्र प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरुभक्ति भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदरुण ध्येय सदा परिभवनमीष्टदोहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरंचन तम शरण्यम भीताहम वनुतपालुभवादीपूत वंदे महापुरष ते चरुनाबिंद यत्दपल्लवनखचंदमनीछटाय विस्फुजीत किमी गोपवधूषर्शि पूर्णागरसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयी कदा कृपाम श्रीकृष्णचैतन्य प्रभुनिदनंद सियादगदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नितानंद सियादैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनकाबुदात संकर्तन कवितरो कमलायुताक्ष भीशाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत्प्रिय करो करुणाभतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमा गंगे तब पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंद दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दीनीत भावाण सदा गंगातरंगरमणीय जटा कलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषित वाम भाग नारायण प्रिय मनंगमदारम वरानसीपुरपति भज विशनाथ वागीशजुष्वदने लक्ष्मीज स वक्षसी यदय संबी सिंगमहम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे 
जे शाम से ईश भगवान दयाद अनंत सर्वात्मनाश्रित पदम यदि निर्वलीखम ते दुस्तराम अतितरंत च देव मायम न ममा मीति सिगाल भक्षे जे शाम से ईश भगवान दयाद अनंत सर्वात्मनाश्रित पदम यदि निर्वलीखम ते दुस्तराम अतितरंत च देव मायम न ममा मीति सिगाल भक्षे गौरी गोष्ठी पति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद <coughs> जगदगुरु टोल आकर गुरु तत्व नित्यानंद बलराम कमिंग हियर इन द फॉर्म ऑफ सदगुरु गौरीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद जगदगुरु टोल आकर गुरु तत्व अनंतदेव नित्यानंद बलराम कमिंग इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड इन द फॉर्म ऑफ सदगुरु टू डेलीवर ऑल बॉन्डेड सोल टू डेलीवर ऑल बॉन्डेड सोल सदगुरु इन द फॉर्म ऑफ सदगुरु कमिंग इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड अनंतदेव कैन कम इन डिफरेंट फॉर्म All your Sadguru, all my Sadguru, those who are actually Sadguru. If not Sadguru, then this Siddhant is not applicable. Simad Bhagaji Mahapran speaking. Je Sham Se Ish Bhagwan Dayavid Anantho. To whom Anantha Dev going to? Best of mercy, of course not directly in the form of Sadguru. That's why many times Prabhupada used to say, "Brahmanu Bhramite kono Bhagwan Jeev, Guru Krishna Prasade Pai Bhakti Lata Bij." In course of traveling through infinity world for infinity period. Jivas are traveling for infinity period, and in course of traveling this infinity world in infinity period, by chance they are going to get the darshan of pure Guru Vishnu. Still, then they cannot understand. If they can get mercy from Sadguru. then they can get some bhakti lata beej bhakti lata beej i already told those who are sadguru those who are busy with bhagavat seva all the 24 hours all the 24 hours 4 hours they are busy with bhagavat seva if you are not going to get enjoyment what you are doing you cannot do you can feel bored If you are not going to get enjoyment to do anything, you cannot do continuously. For some time, you can do. Otherwise, you can, you can feel bored, fed up. But pure Guru Vishnu, they are always hundred percent, all the time busy with Bhagavat Seva. And by watching this kind of Bhagavat Seva mood. You can also develop some desire. You can also develop some desire inside heart. Automatic factor it is. Of course, if there is no aparad inside your heart, then Bhadrajji, if his sanskar is not so bad, he can feel some inspiration to do some something like Guru Vishnu. That is actually Bhakti Lata Beach. Bhakti Lata Beach seed. Bhakti Lata creeper beach seed. That is called seed. By watching a pure Vaishnava, it is a must. If you go in front of a pure Guru Vaishnava, 
If there is no aparad inside your heart, then you can feel some reaction automatically. Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is going to give answer to different questions. In Purushottam Dham Nilachal Khetro, some devotees are asking, how we can know who is, how we can know who is Vaishnava? Then Mahaprabhu consecutively, then Mahaprabhu consecutively for three years, first year when the that question was there, Mahaprabhu speaking the symptom of Kanishta Bhakta. Next year, when same question putting, giving the you know answer about Kanishta Bhakta, Madhyam Bhakta. And last, Mahaprabhu speaking clearly, what is Uttam Bhakta? Uttam Bhakta means pure Bhakta. Uttam Bhakta means by watching, by watching a Uttam Bhakta, by watching a pure devotee, automatically you can think it, you can feel it in inspiration inside to speak Harinam. By watching a pure Vaishnava, you can, uh, you can feel some inspiration to do Harinam. Anyway, Baba speaking, whatever you are watching here, bonded soul, they cannot understand Siddhanta Vichar. When Baba speaking something, they are in confusion. Sometimes Baba speaking this, sometimes speaks, they cannot harmonize. It's called lack of harmony. They cannot harmonize Siddhanta Vichar. Why he told before this, now speaking this, what is, they cannot find harmony. That's why they become isolated. They feel helpless. If they can have a harmony inside heart, harmony when you can get, when you are doing bhajan from heart, when you can give your heart to that Guru Vaishnava, if you can sell your heart, head, you know, you have your head, na? you are playing your head, you are playing your head, na? you have your intellect, everything. But first point of bhajan is to sell your head. You can sell your head. You will have to sell all your head. Suppose you are, you are beheaded, you have no head. You will have to sell your head unto the lotus feet of Gurudev, Sadguru. Then and only then, you can perceive, you can realize about the Aprakite Jagat. Not that I can reserve something of myself and the rest, okay, then you cannot do. That's why the sloka I started, I can explain. Papa speaking, if we are not going to sell our head, I mean submission 100%, Till then, you cannot get 100% Kripa. According to the percentage of your inclination, you can develop some consciousness, not full consciousness. 100% you cannot do. Not possible. Whatever you see in this material world, no? whatever you see in this material world, or whatever you cannot see, because everything you can see, not that, not possible. Whatever you can see and whatever you cannot see in this material world and in transcendental world, all the expression of my Guru, Anantadev. Whatever you see in this material, whatever, all the expression, I mean, from Nityananda, each and every object, if each and every article, object, each and every man, woman, each and everything, if you can think, Nityananda, my Gurudev, wherever you look, wherever you look, anywhere, you can find that your Gurudev is standing. Follow what I say. Whatever you look, 
whatever you look, what you, whatever you cannot do, whatever, whatever you look, you must find your Gurudev in that object. You will have to find. It is compulsory. That is the darshan of Mahabhagavat. In each and every object, everywhere, you will have to see your Gurudev. Suppose I like to do some dirty, dirty thing. Suppose I like to do some very, very dirty thing. Follow. Then Gurudev, if somehow I am enjoying the affection of Gurudev, somehow due to my previous karma fall, due to my weakness, I am feeling some attraction for bad thing, very dirty. Immediately if I am going to do something bad, then I can find their Gurudev, what you are doing, huh? You can find Gurudev, hey, what you are doing? Gurudev watching everything. Guru Charan watching everything, everywhere, Ananta. Ananta Dev. Everywhere you can find everywhere you can find the existence of Gurudev. Everywhere you can find the existence of Sadguru. That is called bhajan. Badaji has so many dirty sanskar. First of all, to make them free of that dirty sanskar. That is the vital point. If dirty sanskar is there inside me, up to this point, or up to this point, I can do Hari Bhajan, it is one kind of story. First point, it is the duty of Guru Vishnu to eliminate all dirty things inside your heart. Anartha is also already there inside, then I am doing Hari Bhajan, who is speaking? Who is speaking? I can try my best to do. It is my practice. It is my practice. I am. It is my practice. I am practicing. But it is. It is not actually Hari Bhajan. Who is speaking lie? Who is going to cheat you? With anartha, nobody can do Hari Bhajan. Preliminary thing is to eliminate your anartha. Why you are hearing Hari Katha? To eliminate all your anartha. All the time you have to do Sankirtan. All the time. It is the order of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. It is the order of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to do Sankirtan all the time. Don't, don't, you know, stop. Go on. Continuous. So all, whatever you see, if you, can, if you cannot find the existence of your Guru Padma, then surely your darshan is not Guru darshan. There is two kinds of darshan. One darshan is Guru darshan, another darshan is Logu darshan. You know Logu? Light darshan. Categorically, I can say there is two types of darshan. Darshan means, you can say philosophy. But what I am saying, it is practically. Philosophy, this word, I cannot accept from heart, totally. Because darshan and philosophy, though, though you are going to translate, darshan means, there is English in the philosophy, but I cannot support. Darshan means more. Philosophy means, Philosophy, those who, are, those who are, you know, going to understand philosophy, they think uh, something concocted, something, you know, philosophical, they not 100% true. But as per Gauriya Darshan, when I am speaking Darshan, so I mean that Darshan. Whenever I am going to speak Darshan, I am not going to mean anything. Darshan means Darshan. Darshan means Practical darshan. Darshan means perfect darshan. 100% perfect. Mind? What I mean to say? All perfect darshan means spiritual darshan. If my eyes is dirty, bhajan means to rectify your darshan. Bhajan means bhajan mean to rectify your darshan. Clearly you will have to clean your heart 
and now you can see clearly of prakita many time you can remember i told na before yatha yatha atma parimijyate asu matpunn gatha sabano vidhanai tatha tatha this shloka i told na yatha yatha atma parimijyate asu matpunn gatha sabano vidhanai tatha tatha pasyati vastu suksham chakshu saiva anjana sab anjana samprajuktam in boyhood a small childhood mother used to use black na my mother used to use black here so that my son can develop can develop eyesight but that is material eyesight but now gurudev goes to gyananjana salaka he is speaking na he is speaking gyananjana salaka same thing my mother used to give black here to increase my sight you know and gurudev giving same but not same it is like same not same gurudev going to give you know anjan gyananjana salakya to develop to help me develop my darshan so that i can see everything anant dev all anant dev bhagwan is only going to reserve will power bhagwan only going to reserve only will power and all other thing anant dev how you can pass how you can pass away guru guru vishnu ha eh? how you can pass away everything nitananda everything nitananda how you can pass away everything all nitananda nitananda mean ananta dev balaram the only thing bhagwan sri krishna going to reserve is that will power will power is totally reserved by bhagwan sri krishna all other thing everything or everything balaram nitananda even dam even all eternal you know parikar all everything coming from shankarshan balaram nityananda nityananda is eternal name we speak balaram we speak we speak we speak ananta dev we speak shankarshan all different name has some different meaning but you are not giving me time that is the main thing shankarshan mean he can cultivate the land there inside your heart field na sankarsan ka cultivate you can cry because first you can feel fry. but all your heart going to crash down because balaram it is a duty of balaram to you know to cultivate the land with plow you know many such document you think is false philosophy no i can show you chaitanya bhagavat chaitanya chaitamito i can show you nandan acharya watching golden plow here in the back of bhagwan balaram you think false will not there so many document i can speak you go i can go on speaking up to my death even after death i can go there there also it is my duty to sing is my seva not that up to my last breath even after eternal seva my seva there i can go on speaking proper told me so sankarsan is most you know merciful in the form of guru pad padma sankarsan like to cultivate my land and after cultivation you can find in different field those who are farmer eh they are going to cultivate the land first after that the land is very good after that they are going to take take seed and put seed na there after that using water everything air sunlight then the uh, you know gradually sprout can come out sprout of bhakti can come out this way the name of sankar 
शंकर शरण कारण तो साई गर्व दुख साई चिपायत दिशाई से सांस्य जश्यांश्यांश कला शनित्यानंद अक्षो रामम शरणम ममास इन दिस श्लोका बिकॉज एवरी इयर आई विल हैव टू अप्रोच फ्रॉम डिफरेंट एंगल मेनी टाइम आई टोल्ड बिफोर मेनी टाइम आई टोल्ड बिफोर अबाउट अबाउट द क्रिएशन अ होल क्रिएशन अ प्राकृत ट्रांसेंडल वर्ल्ड दे आर दामा एवरीथिंग ऑल कमिंग फ्रॉम बलोराम इन ब्रह्म संगीत फाइन ना सहस्रपथम कमलम गोकुलाक्षम महत्पदम तत्कर्णिकारम तद अनंतांश संभव इन दिस मेटेरियल वर्ल्ड अंदर द ट्रांसेंडल वर्ल्ड ऑल वट एवर यू सी ऑल नित्यानंद अनंत देव हरि अनंत हरि रूप अनंत इन्फिनिटी यू आर ए टीनी शोल यू आर हेल्पलेस हाउ यू कैन गेट इन कनेक्शन विथ अनंत देव द कंसेप्ट ऑफ अनंत इन्फिनिटी इन कैलकुलस यू नो मैथमेटिक्स कैलकुलस इज नॉट क्लियर द कंसेप्शन ऑफ इन्फिनिटी इन कैलकुलस आई ऑल्सो यूज टू डू इन बॉय लाइक फुलिश टेंस टू इन्फिनिटी टेंस टू जीरो बट नाउ बाई द मर्सी ऑफ गुरु पाथ पंदी रियलाइज वॉट यू मीन समे इफ यू develop that kind of conception if you close your eyes and watch the ananta brahmanda you can go mad feel oh, what a teeny creature i am what is my existence in this infinity world <coughs> in this infinity world what is my existence who am i so that i am going to express this kind of false ego what is my identity what is my you know existence very small even cannot see infinity small jivatma this way actually this shloka just i just i told from chaitanya chaitamrita shankar sano karana to sai garbha to sai to payad to sai in one line i think because many time before i discussed इन गोलोक वृंदावन भगवान श्री कृष्ण इज देयर भगवान श्री कृष्ण प्लेइंग नंद नंदन भगवान श्री कृष्ण एंड बलोराम कृष्ण बलोराम प्लेइंग ऑलवेज आई टोल्ड द सिद्धांत विचार ऑफ प्रभुपात एंड ऑल शास्त्र दैस कृष्ण एंड बलोराम नॉन डिफरेंट टू इच अदर कृष्ण एंड बलोराम नॉन डिफरेंट टू इच अदर ऑलवेज ऑल ओवर and that balaram which is there inside golokdam vrindavan that is called mool sankarshan original sankarshan and in golok vrindavan that golok vrindavan there is one sheto deep four square four corner sankarshan aniruddha padunno and vasudev vasudev sankarshan aniruddha padunno four corner there is four corner set up eternally present there you can find shankar sandhya chaturbuho it is called chaturbuho four you know four corner that shankar san coming down there in vaikuntha jagat there is also chaturbuho that is golokdam vrindavan and here after that you can find vaikuntha jagat in vaikuntha jagat also you can find four corner outside vaikuntha jagat vaikuntha jagat mean infinity you cannot realize what do you mean by infinity you cannot understand every time this unit follow vaikuntha jagat is also infinity if i say nishingo dev there in the eternal lord there in vaikuntha jagat is uh, finite no nishingo dev there baraha dev there kurmo dev there all eternally present in their own sarupa and each and every dhama is called vaikuntha dhama 
including Sri Ram, <coughs> including Sri Ramchandra, the position of Ramchandra more high, in higher position. This is not discrimination. Ramchandra is going to express more, you know, Leela, more Nishingadev and Baraha. It's called Parabarastha Avastha. Jiva Goswami, Jiva Goswami, Jiva Goswami was speaking, Nishingadev, Parabarastha Avastha, and Ramchandra, little more. Ramchandra doing more Leela. And after that, if you, Vaikuntha Jagat, like the case, gradually we can discuss about Gopakuma. I am discussing Brihad Bhagavatam, you can find Gopakuma reaching Vaikuntha. They are also not give, they are also not getting full satisfaction. After that going, they are gradually they are Golok Vrindavan. So the highest, so the topmost, the maximum most, the maximum most enjoyment, the maximum most facility of enjoyment you can get in Golok Vrindavan. I mean inside Vrindavan forest, I mean in Vrindavan. So in Vaikuntha Jagat there also you can find four corner, Shankarsan, Vasudev Sankarsan, Anidya Paddunna, you can buy. That Sankarsan again coming down to take the form of Karanan of Sai. Karanan, you know, Karanan of Sai, you know? Karan, celestial ocean. Karanan of Sai, that Mahavishnu. About Mahavishnu, many times I told from Brahma Sangita, you can remember that Karanan of Sai is the reason of infinity this material world. Jashaika Nishe Shito Kalo Matavalambo Jivanti Loma Vilaja Jagadandanatha Vishnura Mahanasa Iho Jasu Kalabhishesho Gavindamadi Purusham Tamaham Bajami Brahma Sangita. Exhalation and inhalation. Exhalation in infinity Brahmando coming out. Then again going down. One period, your exhalation, annihilation, every fraction of <laughs> you are doing, no? But that interval, the gapping between, <laughs> you are doing, no? The gapping between exhalation and annihilation of Bhagavan, that is called creation. One time Bhagavan, infinite one. When Bhagavan taking exhalation, annihilation, all going down, inside. That during, that during, that period, during that interval, Jyushvika Nishyeshita Kala Mathava Lambo Jivanti Loma Bilaja Jagadan Nanathaha In hair tip, you know, each and every hair tip, hair tip, there is Ananta Brahmando, one one hair tip. That Mahavishnu. And there, all the authority there, each and every bond, each and every Brahmanda, there is authority, na? A Brahma, this, that, so many authority. They are also going to you know, take the responsibility for, due, for that time period. When that time period is over, you try to understand the meaning of this slope. Jyashaika Nishyashita Kala Mathavalambo Jivanti Jivanti when they are alive, going to take the responsibility up to that duration period. Jivanti Loma Biloja, Loma Biloja, Jagadanda Nathaha, those who are the, you know, those who are taking charge of this world, Brahma, Sankar, Indra, all. Oh. So, Jusseika Nishyashita Kala Mathavalambo, Jivanti Loma Vilaja Jagadanda Natha, Vishnu Mahana Sa Iho, Jasho Kala Vishesho. There is Vishnu Mahano, Mahavishnu, is the Kala. Govinda there originally, from there, down, 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 down coming, this Kala. So, what to speak about Govinda? Now, I like to explain this word Ananda. Nityananda, na? So, 
Nityananda, his name is Nityananda. His name is Sankarsan, he is a Balaram, okay. But now I like to explain the name Nityananda. Usually, we know the meaning of Nityananda. Nityananda means? Nitto, Nitto plus Ananda, you know? In Sanskrit grammar, you have to speak. Nitta, Nitta plus Ananda. Mean? Eternal Ananda. What do you mean? Eternal Ananda, no? So that eternal Ananda can never be killed. Follow. That eternal Ananda existence that can never be killed is eternal Ananda. Like Hiranyakasipu wanted to kill Prahlad Maharaj. Oh, idiot. Kill him. Foolish. But Hiranyakasipu foolish number one. He don't know that inside the heart of inside the heart of Prahlad there is Nityananda, eternal Ananda existing. No enmity, no karma, no jealousy, nothing. Those pure sadhu, if you like to kill them, Bhagavan can kill you. You can try to kill them. Pure sadhu, if you like to kill them, make some politics, you can go away to garbage for infinity period. <laughs> Bhagavan can never excuse. Especially, those who are going to glorify Bhagavan by acharan, not only lecture. Those who are going to glorify Bhagavan all the time, 24 hours, and their acharan, their exclusive acharan, acharan mean, what do you mean by acharan? Every time I need to speak two or three times. He cannot remember. Acharan means bhajan. How you love Bhagavan. Acharan doesn't mean I can take bath two, three times, Maharaj, I can clean my clothes. It's okay. It is also purity. Acharan means, what do you mean by acharan? Bhajan. How you love. How you love Bhagavan. How you are feeling tremendous attraction for Bhagavan. How you are feeling helpless without Bhagavan. Your serving mood, it is called bhajan. So those who are pure sadhu, eternal ananda is there. Paramahya Siddhar Goswami Maharaj, Paramahya Bhakti Pumat Puri Goswami, eternal ananda. One thing you believe, that if there is no ananda, you are not going to live. Why people going to commit suicide? You know the reason? Why? Speak out. Why they like to commit suicide? Why? They wanted to enjoy. They wanted to enjoy. But they could not get that object of enjoyment. They like to commit suicide. If something, somebody can say, Maharaj, they commit suicide. Say, so, uh, what kind of ananda there? Oh, Ananda was there. They could not discover it inside her. They are running toward false Ananda. Follow what I say. Ananda eternally, if not there, then why in Gita Bhagavan speaking? Why Gita Bhagavan speaking? That Ananda is eternally present. No, no, I know. No abhava vidyate shataha. No abhava vidyate shataha. If you cannot get realization from Guru Vaishnava, if you think this is enjoyment and running to a dirty thing, you know what you can do? Main point is that, what is the main reason of your suicide? What do you wanted to commit suicide? Because you wanted to get enjoyment. But you know, don't know the definition of enjoyment. You wanted to commit suicide because you wanted to get enjoyment, dirty enjoyment. But you have no definition of perfect enjoyment. That's why you commit suicide. So ananda is the basic thing. Who is going to commit suicide? Behind this thing, originally you can find 
he wanted to get enjoyment, na? Ananda, na? He wanted to get enjoyment, he could not get. That's why he commits. So, so that means, Ananda is the original thing. Without Ananda, nobody likes to live. Without Ananda, who is going to lead their life? Even a mosquito don't like to live. They like to take new, new blood from... Eh? A pig like to take new, new stool. Very... Very easy. So everybody like to and lead life according to their own sanskar. They like to enjoy. That is the original root cause. Root cause, original thing. Hiranyakasipu wanted to kill Prahlad Maharaj. But Hiranyakasipu don't know he cannot kill Prahlad. He wanted to arrange poison. He wanted to throw Prahlad Maharaj from the uh, hilltop in the ocean. He wanted to confine him in a cave where you cannot get even oxygen. What to speak about, you know, prasadam. No oxygen. Confined. Suffocation, you can die. Hiranyakasipu is going to throw Prahlad into a hot oil, you know, big, uh, in a pot, oil. I'm going to throw Prahlad. Going to throw into fire. Eh? Going to cut with sharp weapon. Trident, they are going to kill. The trident going from here and there, Prahlad Mahaji, Prahlad Maharaj. Feeling nothing trouble. Because Prahlad Maharaj, Hiranyakasipu, we don't know, Nityananda is there inside his heart. How he can kill? It is the foolishness, it is the foolishness on the part of Hiranyakasipu to think that I can kill eternal agent. Prahlad enjoying bhakti, eternal enjoyment. How he can kill him? He is trying his best, but he don't know. Eternal enjoyment, Atat Nityananda, is always present everywhere. Everywhere. That eternal enjoyment can never be killed. You can try your best, but eternal enjoyment. Eternal enjoyment also there inside your heart. Also inside your heart, everybody's heart. Only the thing, you will have to discover the thing. All contradiction, all question, all fighting can come to an end. Finish. Follow. You will have to get Kripa. That it, you will have to discover. It is already there inside you. Because Jivatma, all eternal, Jivatma, pure, Chinmay, Eternally present, Anandamai, Gyanmai, I already told. Now I can come to the point that our Nithananda, who is the root cause of all bhakti, who is the root cause of all bhakti, otherwise Gaurang Mahaprabhu cannot give bhakti. Nithananda Babu is the root cause of you know, bhakti, he can distribute bhakti. Our Nithananda Balaram, I am going to touch on point. He, he, you all know, he took birth there in a chakra dam, Garbhavas. There, Harai Pandi, Nithananda, Harai Pandi, then Padavati Ma, he used to play different kind of game, like Ram Lila, eh, different kind of Lila, a small boy. They used to play. I have no time to discuss. One day, one sannyasi coming to their house and staying there for some days, taking prasadam, they are enjoying. After that, while going away, that sannyasi, that sannyasi asking, that sannyasi asking to Harai Pandit, Father, I like to ask something. Can you give me Alam, you can give me bhiksha. Yes, why not? Anything I ask, you can give me. Yes, I can give. If you never mind, I am growing old age. 
I am going for different pilgrimage. Could you, could you please give your, this boy? Could you please give your, this boy with me, Nityananda, so that I can travel? I can keep protection. I can give protection to this small boy from heart. I promise you. Can you give me? Whenever the sannyasi is going to speak this way, then Harai Pandit fall down on ground. Unconscious. Lose consciousness. After a long time, when he come back, I mean when consciousness come back, he was bound to offer Nityananda in the hand of in the hand of that sannyasi. And with that sannyasi, Nityananda Babu traveling all different places. I have no time to discuss all in details. A big, you know. Finally, Nityananda Prabhu going to Vrindavan Dham, there is plain. And where the sannyasi gone? There is no such details. There is different kind of speculation with this point. Different kind of speculation. Somebody is speaking this, somebody. But as for Siddhanta, we can say the elder brother of the elder brother of Kauranga Mahaprabhu. The elder brother of Gauranga Mahapu, what is the Vishwarup? Vishwarup, eh? you know. What do you mean by Vishwarup? What do you mean by Vishwarup? I already, in my starting you know, speech, I started. Vishwarup means whatever you live, whatever you see, you can say Vishwarup. I mean, Guru, I mean, Anantadev. You see, Vishwarup means Vishwa. Vishwa means material world, all infinity world. Material and transcendental world. Vishwa rup means Vishwa. Vishwa rup. Whatever you see is the expression of Nityananda. Anantadev. So the name, so the name Vishwa rup, so the name Vishwa rup going to clarify that, the name Vishwa rup going to clarify that is Guru Tattva. The name Vishwarup is going to clarify very clearly, clarify, is Nityananda Tattva. He is Anantadev. How Anantadev? You just told Nityananda Anantadev. You know, we are in confusion. Sometimes speaking this, sometimes speaking, we cannot understand. Foolish. <laughs> Actually, Vishwarup is also Anantadev. And Nityananda Prabhu, because Vishwarup is, is, is a manifestation of Anantadev. Because without Anantadev, Bhagavan cannot, you know, come. Without Anantadev, Bhagavan cannot come. So first Vishwarup took birth, and in Vrindavan Lila, first, you know, Balaji Maharaj took birth, after that, Krishna took birth. Balaji Maharaj took birth. After that, Krishna took birth. Follow. This way we see Vishwarup going to make the background. Vishwarup going to make the background on the basis of which our Prabhu can get green signal. When you know, when train going, plane going. And, and here also, there is traffic signal, you don't know. If there is mistake of signal, traffic signal in the space, if there is mistake, hey, you go down, 1,000 1, feet down, and in the meantime, some traffic, you know, misguided another, you also go down, another plane coming, then collide. This thing happened many times. Misguidance. This traffic is speaking this, and that traffic is speaking this. They have no connection thus. So this way, our Vishwarup is going to make the background on the basis of which our Nimai, our Gauranga can come. Vishambar. Vishwarup, Vishambar. 
Vishwarup is elder brother Vishwarup. Vishwarup gone to a very small age. Very small age gone from house. Like I told the mother, you're 12, 12 years gone. 12 years, 11 years gone from. Gone from house, took sannyas. Ultimately, we have information from Chaitanya Charitamito. In Maharashtra, one place, Kolapur, one place. There, actually, Sankarsan, I mean, this Vishwarup, Lip body. Our Mahaprabhu also went to visit that place. His name was Sankararana. When it when he took sannyas, his name was Sankararana. Anyway, what I mean to say that Anantadev coming directly at Nityananda, Balaram, and also coming in the form of Vishwaru. But Nityananda is not going to manifest himself. Nityananda is going to play inside Vindhava. Whole day, like with small coward boys playing whole day. Because Gauranga Mahapu can give instruction, you come, then can come. Gauranga Mahapu manifests himself gradually, expressing different kind of Leela. People started realizing he is not man. Follow, different kind of Leela. After that, giving inspiration to Nityananda. Now I am going to express myself, you come. Till then, Nityananda Babu was playing. Nityananda Babu is doing his own Leela. And one very important point, Nityananda Babu, why wearing eh, blue cloth? You can see. Why Nityananda Babu going to wear blue clothes? Why? One day, there was aerial voice. You are Ananta Dev. Cloth and everything. You have to wear this cloth. Nityananda Babu, Ananta Dev, and blue is a signal of infinity. If you look at sky, you can buy blue sky. So why Nityananda Babu? Nobody, nobody have a right to wear blue cloth. I mean devotees. Non-devotees they can prove. Non-devotees are not speaking. Blue cloth we have no right to wear. Blue cloth cannot be wear. Only Nityananda. It is a symbol of, symbol of infinity, Anantadev. So Nityananda playing there in Vindavan whole day and night. Playing. When our Gauranga Mahapu is going to give signal, they come to me. Then Nityananda gradually coming here. Otherwise, Nityananda was doing all pilgrimage. Even Gauranga Mahapu not going all everywhere. Nityananda Babu, in small age, for 10, 12 years, totally traveling, different place. Even our Gauranga Mahapu not going to all pilgrimage. But one spectacular thing, I like to remind you, that you can go through, you can go through Shastra, you can go to Shastra, Shastra to search out where Nityananda Babu gone. All different pilgrimage. All you can search. And jot down, jot down, you know, in a paper. You can jot down in a paper and try to reconcile it with the pilgrimage of Balaram. If you don't believe me, you can go through Bhagavatam and all different Shastra. There also, Balaji Maharaj going, what all different pilgrimage in Bhagavatam, not in details. But other Puran, there is there. Balaram first going to here, Naimi Sharana here. So, you can jot down all the pilgrimage done by, you know, traveled, traveled by Nityananda. You can say same. Same. In the form of Balaji Maharaj traveling here and there, or same pilgrimage Nityananda going to travel. Even Nityananda going to Basa Gufa. Basadev Goswami personally coming out and playing the lotus feet of Nityananda. 
Vasudev Goswami from Vasa Gupha coming out. My master coming. My Guru. Bhagavan. So now point is that Nityananda Prabhu now coming here according to the indication of Gauranga. But very secretly, nobody knows. And going to take shelter in the house of Nandana Acharya Bhavan. There many times you speak Harikatha at present everywhere, different kind of problem. So I stop. That Nandana Acharya Bhavan, Nithyananda going, Nandana Acharya making one accommodation for Nithyananda, and just like intoxication, closing eyes, red eyes, cannot see properly. Hello. Nithyananda Prabhu staying there. Now, morning time, one day morning time, Gorang Mahapu speaking. Oh devotees, today in dream I see something. What do you see? I see one big, one big chariot. It's named Taladhaj. You know? You know. All the name of Jagannath Rath, Balaram Rath, all different name. Different name there. Taladhaj is the name of the chariot of Balaram. Taladhaj. Follow. Taladhaj. Gorangama was speaking, just in the morning time, I was supposed to get up. I find one dream. Oh, what dream? Well, one big chariot coming. All very effulgence. And one Mahapurush coming down from the chariot and asking, what is the, where is the house of Nimai? Where is the house of Nimai? Mahapur speaking, tall figure, all effulgence coming. So I think some, you know, something going to happen. Okay, could you please search all over? Navadip, you can go. You all, Mahapur speaking, you search out. I see dream, then it must be, it must be true. You go and search where that, you know, gigantic personality, super personality, who is that? You search out. Go and search. There from morning to now, morning to evening, like mad such. Yeah, anybody coming to your house? Anybody coming to your house? All house. All in the They're coming. Prabhu, we search out, we search out all, you know, we search out all, you know, nobody, nobody there. Foolish. Come with me. Mahaprabhu come with me. All devotees following Mahaprabhu. Mahaprabhu directly going to enter the Nandana Chaja Bhama, just the next door. They're going to omit. <laughs> just next door. Here yeah, who can come? Just the next door, they're going to omit. I'm searching whole Navadhi. They're not getting. Mahaprabhu, foolish, come with me. Mahaprabhu coming. Mahaprabhu leading. And going there and enter into the house of Nandana Chaji Bhavan and find Anantade Balaram in intoxication, closing eyes, this way, this way, doing. My master coming. Nitya my master, my Prabhu coming today. Then after that, Gorangma says, You look. You see, look. Gorang Mahapu pay pranam to him. Then what pranam? Everybody. I was speaking about him. Yes or not, he coming. Then Nithyananda Prabhu, you know, going to you know, stand out, approaching towards Mahaprabhu, shedding tears like mad, like fire brigade man, you know, water. Gauranga also crying and going to embrace each other and Nityananda Babu gone faint, faint. Anantadev in the lap of Gauranga going to stay inactive. Nityananda Prabhu is the most active. I mean, all activity in the infinity world going, but now he is going to express inactive Lila. 
he leave his body. Faint. Gauranga Mahaprabhu catch him. After that, this way different kind of Leela going on. This is the Nityananda and Gauranga Milan. Milan means unification. Milan. After that, onward different kind of Leela going on, different Sankita and everything. Our Gauranga speaking, Sripad, Sripad, your Vyasa Puja, you have to do Vyasa Puja tomorrow. And the, though we can find in Shastra, though we can find in Shastra, Vyasa Puja is eternally present. You cannot believe. Not that Vyasa Puja was invented by somebody. Vyasa Puja is eternally present in Shastra. But who is going to understand? We have a Vyasa Panchak. We have a Vyasa Panchak. We know. So, Vyasa Puja eternally present. So, Vyasa Puja is the original reason of all success. If I am not going to do Vyasa Puja, all Shastra, all different Harikatha cannot come on my tongue. And my tongue cannot come. Not that forcefully I can memorize some philosophy and speak to, the, to get clapping. Not that. It less interest. When nobody there, in Surya Kunda, I am speaking like mad. Harikatha. Man, nobody there. <laughs> to Bhagavan. Harikatha is not for. It's the mercy of Bhagavan. So, Gauranga Mahapu speaking, O Vaisa. Gorang Mahaprabhu was speaking to Sripad Nityananda. O oh, Sripad, tomorrow it is your duty to do Vyasa Puja, your Vyasa Puja. Then Gorang Mahaprabhu asking, which place you prefer? Which place you prefer for this function of Vyasa Puja? Which spot, which space, which place you prefer? Then Nityananda speaking, Pointing out, Sivas Pandit, Sivas Pandit. Nitanda pointing out, Sivas Pandit. More Vyasa Puja, a Bhaman are ghar. Bhaman mane is Brahman. His house. Okay, as you like. Sivas Pandit speaking, everything there in my house, no travel. We can arrange, you know, ghee, I mean, clarified butter. You know, card and you know, to do the abhishek of milk, everything. No problem, everything, sugar, honey, what not, everything in my house. Because he is Brahman, na? usually in the house of Brahman, those are original Brahman, you can find all stuff. Follow. Then the day of Basa Puja, Gorang Mahapu going. And coming in the house of Sivas Pandit, all devotees doing Sankita, nice. Then, Sivas Pandit is you know, giving one garland in the hand of, you know, Vyasa Puja, all done by, you know, Sivas and Nityananda Prabhu is present there. Sivas Pandit giving one garland in the hand of Nityananda, you pay Dandavat to Vyasa Deva. And give garland. Though he is infinite in time, Nityananda. But it is a duty. He is going to teach us. You give the garland and then in, in, the, in the neck of, you know, in the soldier of Vasudeva. Nityananda not doing any function. Srivastava, you speak. Om Nama. Hey, <laughs> you speak. Srivastava, you speak mantra. Take, take Puspanjali. Take Puspanjali. Speak, Nama, this, that, Nityananda not speaking. He is speaking Nama, he is speaking something else. Sivas Pandit sitting and speaking, you take, do archan of us. He is not doing archan, he is laughing and like mad. Then finally Sivas Pandit is going to complain with Gorangma. Prabhu, your Sivas not doing archan, not speaking on Nama, this is not speaking. Hey, Nityananda Prabhu. Nityananda, do archan, ha ha ha, laughing. And standing up with a garland, 
standing up like a mad, like a madman, like a drunkard, taking the garland and looking everywhere, here, yeah, there, yeah, laughing, ho, 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 and coming, giving the garland to Gauranga. Eh? You are supposed to give the garland to Vyas. You give the garland to Gauranga. Because giving, because, because giving garland to Gauranga is the same thing. Vyasadeva. This way, Nityananda Prabhu all the time like child, like child. When going to swim in Ganga, one crocodile going to catch the crocodile. Hey, don't go there, crocodile. That time crocodile was there, sir, crocodile. And until recently, I, I saw there was, you know, dolphin. The all, those were demon. There was a demon, Rakshas. Rascal, they are going to kill everything. Night time, when nobody there, you catch and sell. Dolphin was there. I saw many, many dolphins there, there. But now, nobody. All they kill. Nityananda, Gauranga, all devotees taking bath, but Nityananda is going to swim and catch the crocodile. Hey! They are going to catch. Up! Get up! Quickly! This way. Like child. When Nityananda coming, then Gauranga is going to give the full treasure to Nityananda in the heart. In Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya you can find Gauranga Mahapu speaking. Gauranga Mahapu, when giving the garland, Nityananda Prabhu watching the six sandal Gauranga, Sharabhuj Murti, and go faint. Giving darshan to Nityananda. And when Gauranga is doing, what happened, Sipad, get up, what do you want more? The reason for why you are coming here, Sankirtan Yoga, everything, it is in, in, in your hand, I give. All the responsibility to, to give prema. Gauranga passing, come here, don't forget. Don't forget, Gauranga Mahapu passing, I can show you. Gauranga Mahapu speaking, it is your property. Prema is your property. I am going to give this all property in and wherever you like, you can distribute. Find the meaning. You understand the meaning, inner meaning. What do you mean? Mahaprabhu, it is your property, your sole property. I give in your hand. Wherever you like, you can distribute. Wherever you like, it is your property. Mahaprabhu is going to come in. Even Jagai Madai, they are successful to get Rama. Of course, this kind of conception should come inside your heart that I am more fallen soul than Jagai Madai. If this kind of conception is not coming, then I cannot become Vaishnava. If you are going to depend upon your own capacity, power, education, till then you cannot come out successfully. That's why Krishnadas Kubirat Goswami is going to teach us to get the mercy of Nityananda Balaram, we should develop this kind of bhava. What is that? Jagai madai hoite muise papishto. Puri sher kit hoite muise logishto. Mor naam, eh? Jai loay tar paap hoay. Mor naam jai shune tar punno khoay. Amon nighin no more keba kiba kore. Ek Nityananda binu jagat bhaja. Try to understand. You can memorize. You know, in your heart, engrave. You try to engrave in your heart. Don't forget. That is the basic thing. Basic thing of bhajan. Externally, somebody can say, Bancha Kalpudu, it is not that. Kapat. But from heart, who is 100% him, how you can realize. Many times I discuss. So you see, I am more fallen soul than Jagai Madhai. What to speak about Jagai Madhai? What to speak about yoga? Even I am more fallen than the insect you can find in a stool. Puri Sher Kitwete. In a stool, you can find some sort of insect can be there. I am more fallen than that. Who is going to speak my name? He is going to, you know, he is going to lose his Sukriti. Going to lose his Punno Khoi. Who is going to speak my name? He is going to incur aparad, pap, pap, sin. 
Aparad, no sin. Sin, crying, and offense. You know, article you've gone through, they can energetically. So this kind of temperament should be there. Then and only then, you can find inside Gurudev, Vaishnav, Nityananda, you can clearly see. The day you can develop this kind of mood, Seva mood, humble mood, you can clearly see inside my Gurudev Nityananda. You can clearly see. Now blind, cannot see. Now cannot see. This way, together with Nityananda, Mahaprabhu started Sankirtan Jagya. Sankirtan, the reason for why Mahaprabhu. Follow. With Nityananda, Mahaprabhu started. And Mahaprabhu giving order to Nityananda and Harida. Shuno Shuno Nityananda, Shuno Haridas. Ho Nityananda Haridas, it is my, you know, it is my desire, it is my instruction. You can go door to door and try to distribute the Harinam Prem, Nam Prem. You go. Then Nityananda Babu, according to the order of Gorang Mapu, Haridas Thakur and Nityananda going to market, different place, to distribute Harinam. And the, in the way of distributing Harinam, when Nityananda was speaking to Haridas, speaking, Prabhu, don't go, they are drunkard. Jagai Madai, don't go. Hey, speak Harinam. What? You speak Hari Krishna, Harinam. Then they become angry and take the you know, one broken part of one pitcher, mart, mart pitcher, throw Nityananda card. Blood coming out, that is also to make fool of you. Nityananda, blood coming, man like me. So say, how I can know is Bhagavan? Foolish. When Pitama Vishwa going to do arrow, and Krishna, blood coming, to make fool of you. Krishna's body turns in my heart, is also blood coming, to make fool of you. To make fool of you. Bhagavan, Jogumaya doing this. So blood coming out. Gorang Mahapu got information running. Who has done this case? The Jagai Madai. Ah? Jagai Madai? Mahapu started calling Sudarshan. I can cut the throat. Nitananda going to catch. Prabhu, this is not good. Because it is your commitment. But because this incarnation, anyway you are not going to catch any weapon. It is a commitment. I never mind. They are ignorant. They throw, you know, one portion of pitcher, mud portion. I, I never fear. You will have to deliver them. When Nityananda is going to pray to Gauranga Mahapu that way, then Gauranga Mahapu, well, you are speaking? Yes, it's my request. On their behalf, I request you, please deliver them. Please deliver them. Then Gorang Mahaprabhu speaking. Then in the meantime, Anna, Madai started crying. Jagai also could realize that he has done mistake. Going to take shelter. Gorang Mahaprabhu speaking. All your sinful, countless sinful activities you have done. I am going to take everything. Provided, provided you can give me assurance. Yeah, that you can do no more sinful activities. If you commit, if, if you are going to promise me that you are not going to do any sinful activities in future, Prabhu, we promise you cannot do. Then Gorang Mahapu giving blessing, embrace, they are going to all, you know, sinful, countless drinking, going to Prosquata, they are all Gorang Mahapu taking, absorbing, like blotting paper, you know, Blotting paper on those when childhood we used to read, write with you know ink and some extra ink. And what to do with blotting paper? We still childhood, boyhood, but now fountain and you know gone. Now this way, Mahaprabhu going to take all sinful activities from them, make them pure. 
and Mahaprabhu giving warning to everybody. It is the it is the desire of Nityananda. That's why I was I was bound to deliver them. You all should not remember that they have done no, they done they done they done so much wrong activities. They done so much wrong activity, sinful activity in their life. They done so much activity. You should not remember. Don't remember. Now they are Vaishnav. When they are Vaishnav, you cannot speak. Well, you you know you were habituated to drink wine, don't speak there. All previous sinful activity you cannot remind because they are not Vaishnav. This way, Krishnadas Kovidas Goswami is speaking only by the mercy of Nityananda. Even Gauranga Mahapur is not going to see, show this kind of mercy. Even Gauranga Mahapur cannot show this kind of mercy. Nityananda is going to show mercy. This way, by the mercy of Nityananda, only by the mercy of Nityananda, we can get this kind of facility to get the keeper. And also, it is the commitment of Nityananda. In Kirtan also, you know, na? In Kirtan also, you are doing, na? Amare ke liya laho bhajo gauro hari Eta boli Nityananda bhume gori jai Sonara parvata jana You don't know? Don't do Kirtan? Eh? You do, na? Ah, no, not doing. That's why you are, you know. You should go and see. Atoboli Nityananda Bhume Gorijaya. Going to roll down on ground like golden, golden piece, golden hill. Sonara Parvat, golden hill. Going to roll. Amare Kinyar, you try to buy me and speak Gaurhari. Do bhajan of Gaurhari. Nityananda speaking. Hey, you do bhajan of Gaurhari and try to buy me. You can, I, I can sell myself to you. If you can speak gold. And also, in Nityananda, you know, a stotra you can find, written by Bindavanda Shakur Mahasaya. Hello. Uh, it is written by Krishnadas Kabiraj Gusai. Uh, Bindavanda Shakur Mahasaya, one, one Krishnadas. Uh, uh, no, no. Uh. See, Jannavas Chakam is written by uh, Krishnadas Kabiraj. Uh, a previous one, Sarachanda Bhanting Spuradamala, this is written by Bindavanta. So Bindavanta Stakur is the last disciple of last disciple means eternal person. Last disciple doesn't mean, oh he came less, oh not there. I am speaking last disciple, okay. <laughs> but not there. He is the eternal person of Nithyananda. There he is right, Nithyananda speaking. Nithyananda speaking. Ato ba saṃsāraṁ buddhitaran dāyo mahilaget. Nithyananda speaking, the whole responsibility lies with me. The whole total responsibility lying, the whole, I mean tot, the total responsibility lying with me. Come, it is my duty to, to, to deliver you. It is my duty to help you to cross over. It is my duty to help you to cross over this material world. Why you are lamenting? Come. But you have to speak Gaurhari. You have to speak Gaurhari. So many Siddhanta Bichara like to. But time cannot permit. I wrote one book, bound to read, write, because some demonic character, Acharya, he wanted to. He wanted to criticize Nityananda. He started criticizing Nityananda. Nityananda is sannyasi. How possible he is going to marry? I give fitting, fitting answer. Then I make him stop. He is now die. This kind of demonic character, they are acting as Acharya. They are going to criticize Nityananda. Nityananda is sannyasi. How do I So many things I like to speak, but I think this is a vital point I should touch. And if the time permits, someday again, next week I can discuss what? At a time, so many discussions I cannot do. I feel helpless. 
बिकॉज ओशन ऑफ हरि कथा आई लाइक टू क्लैरिफाई दिस पॉइंट मे बी इट विल टेक सम टाइम फर्स्ट पॉइंट यू शुड नॉट फॉरगेट फ्रॉम भागवतम वी कैन फाइंड वन श्लोका ज्ञानिष्ठ विरक्त बा मद भक्त बा अनपेक्षक सलिंगानम आश्रम स्थाता चरित अभिधि गोचरा हलो बड़े से फुलिस ज्ञानिष्ठ विरक्त बा ज्ञानिष्ठ विरक्त बा मद भक्त बा अनपेक्षक सलिंगानम आश्रम स्थाता चरित अभिधि गोचरा दोज आर परमांसा दोज आर अबदूत अबदूत यू नो अबदूत क्रेजी आउट ऑफ प्रेम आर दे क्रेजी बट दे डिंग दे डोंट नो इफ दे आर गोइंग टू थ्रो ऑल द सिंटम ऑफ भजन आई मीन द रेड क्लोथ व्हाइट क्लोथ डांडा कमांडोल और तिलक माला और इफ दे थ्रो एवरीथिंग बिकॉज यू नो I cannot speak in Nanda Nataji Bhavan. Nitananda going to break his own kamandul and danda back. I can explain someday. It will take long time to you know to establish this siddhanta. Why Nitananda breaking? Why Nitananda going to break that danda of Gauranga? What can be the reason? So many siddhanta vichar. We will have to you know wait and watch. Nitananda Babu going to break his own Dandan command rule because the reason for why man going to take Dandan command rule that is finished. Follow why? Because as because after taking sannyas, after taking sannyas, I can explain in Hindi today night time. <laughs> What to do? Follow. Danda. After taking Danda, Mahaprabhu is going to speak this. You know, in Chaitanya Charitamrita, Prabhu ko he, Prabhu ko he, Shanyas Brato koi logo hon Mukundo sevai hai Sankshataran. I mean, the deep inner meaning of Sanyas is to dedicate your life, soul, and everybody, everything in the name of Bhagwan. It's called actual Sanyas. So Adhyatma Gosai is topmost Sanyas. Vishnu Priya Devi, Tapma Sanyas. You cannot understand the meaning. You think one danda, ah, I'm danda. Give me pranami. I'm danda. Sanyas. Pay danda what to me? <laughs> Not danda. Foolish. Fallen soul can never take danda command rule. Foolish. Their activity can prove that they are not in line. So the inner meaning of danda is to serve Bhagwan from heart. Follow. External danda is okay, but external danda is not all. Bhakti Mita is speaking. External danda, external sannyas, cloth, apron is not all. Main thing inside your heart, how you are feeling. That is the main thing. Nitananda Prabhu is Avadut. Nitananda Prabhu is Avadut Sanyasi. Avadut means he can keep Danda Kamal, Kamandula, can throw, or can exhibit any kind of lila. Because he is Ananta Dev. If you are going to criticize him, it's totally prohibited. As per the indication, someday I can discuss. In Purushottam Dham, Nilachal Khetro, all devotees they used to go to Nilachal Khetro. You know, all devotees to meet with Gorang Mahapu during the Chatur Masa. You know, you know Chatur Masa. While coming back, Gorang Mahapu giving some speech. Gorang Mahapu going to and uh, do some secret meeting. Nobody there. Only Nityananda go. Nobody allowed. In the secret meeting, Goranga Mahapu wanted to suggest to Nityananda, but clearly you cannot understand. By the activities of Nityananda, you can realize what instruction given. 
people they can criticize but they should remember netananda babu cannot do anything without the instruction of gauranga this thing you should not forget if at all netananda babu going to marry by the desire of gauranga you should remember you should remember this is according to the order of gauranga but direct document you cannot find but the activity is going to prove otherwise why gauranga nithyanand was coming here immediately going to break dandan kamul through useless no need are he himself is bhagwan and with the same reason i can explain some day nithyanand babu going to break the danda of gauranga with danda gauranga babu giving gauranga babu speaking you chaitanya babu you you sir bad you just catch my danda i'm just coming and nithyanand in the meantime going to break the danda and throw in chandabhaga nadi gauranga babu coming back where is my danda actually is broken how broken you are full of prema you ja you you come and embrace me we both fall on the on the danda and danda broken into three pieces ha huh? three pieces i give you responsibility to take control of my danda give my danda i don't like to hear anything give my danda i don't know where is danda then mahaprabhu going to show some in the anxiety i cannot go with you the only the only property i have the danda you break that i am penniless i cannot go with you i can go either you can go fast i can go back or i can go fast you can go back mahaprabhu running i cannot do you break my danda is one kind of lila mahaprabhu running why nitananda breaking nitananda bro when mahaprabhu going to give the danda and gone gorang mapu gone to some other place to take bath or something then nitananda was taking the danda in front of him ah foolish eh nitananda was talking with the danda you foolish my prabhu is all in all infinity brahmanda nayak idiot he is going to he is going to carry you eh idiot i can give punishment and break nitananda was talking with the danda it is written infinity brahmand bhagwan carrying you know you know and you foolish mahapur going to carry you you don't feel sigh i can give punishment breaking and throw this way infinity the topics of ananta dev is ananta the topics of ananta dev is ananta itself now i like to speak so many thing but cannot speak so the shloka i started with this i can touch and maybe in the evening time and night time i can explain in hindi what to speak je sham sa esha bhagwan daye daye is ananta to whom nithanand babu balaram going to best to keep up who is 100% inclined sarvatmana asid badam je nirvalikam two word one is niskapat and that is 100% sarnagati tolo one is niskapat ba another is 100% sarnagati je sham sa eshu bhagwan daya id anant daya id anant sarvatmana sirva by body speech and mind totally inclined and nirvalikam nirvalikam mane without kapat ba this nirvalikam this word without duplicity and this 100% inclination both word you know related to each other both words because if not nirvil if if, if you are not going to develop discovered bab you cannot you cannot you know show 100% inclination and if you are not 100% inclination until and unless you are not 100% inclination you cannot develop you cannot develop eh niskapat ba duplicity you cannot avoid so two words it seems at uh, the two words separate one is sarvatmana asidu padam 
Yadi nirvalikam, nirvalikam and sarvanam, those related to each other. If one is satisfied, automatically the other is also satisfied. Follow. If 100% inclined, then, then niscovered. And if you are niscovered, then and only then you can force them. And after there is very important thing it is written. Jesham Sayesha Bhagavan Dayaed Ananta Sharvatmana Siddha Padam Jodi Nirval Nir Jodi Nirvalikam Te Dustaram. Only they and only they. Only they. Only they and only they. They can cross over this material ish, material ocean of Maya. Those who can realize any time my body eh? Anytime my body can go, anytime jackal, jackal, dog can take the flesh of my body. Those who can realize from heart. This my useless body, anytime jackal or dog or tiger can take up. This is the utility of this body. This is the actual utility of your body to do Hari Bhajan. Otherwise, it is one kind of lunch dish, you know, lunch dish. Noon time lunch is for a one kind of nice lunch dish for jackal. This you should realize from heart. Don't express false ego. This way you can come out successful. So again, if I discuss next year, I can discuss from different angle. Because time cannot permit. Hari Ananta, Hari Rupa Ananta. Jesham Sayesha Bhagavan Dayaeda Ananta Sarvatmana Siddhapadam Jodi Nirvalikam Te Dustaram Atitaranti Chadeva Mayam No Mamaho Miti Sha Sigal Bhakshi Nitananda Padadandam Jesham Hitkarnikalai Tesham Dasano Dasaham Prasidan to Sadaivahi Vancha Kalpaturu Sikabas in the Bhavish. But it's an unpopular